was um, it's been a great start to the season, and I suppose you got on the score sheet last week up in Trini in a big win as well. You must have been delighted. Yeah, definitely. I mean, I don't score too many goals, but hopefully get a few more and help the team. But yeah, definitely. I don't know. After the first, well, the first game we won six 0 and then a little bit of, of a slow spell there, and then now we're flying again. So hopefully we can continue that and keep on. But even when you mentioned a slow spell, I mean. It, it was a defeat against Galway that you probably should have won and just, yeah. just a bad game up in Longford for both yeah. teams. Overall, it's been a pretty positive start, hasn't no, it? No, definitely. I think well, one goal conceded in six games now is it is positive and we have a lot of goals as well. So I think the whole team's performing well and hopefully we can take it a game at a time and hopefully we can look back and, and there'll be a bit of a gap of points at the top at some point then. But uh, I don't know, can't jump too far ahead now. We just got to take one game at a time. And, you mentioned a lot of goals. Um, I mean, it has been really apart from obviously the Galway and the the uh, the Longford game. Um, it's like six against Bray, four the other night in Treaty, and yeah. two against um, Cove and Waterford. I mean, it's, it's been a lot of goals scored and only one goal conceded. So, you as a defender, you must be delighted with how the defense is playing, and um, they have in a goal as well. It's been a strong unit, hasn't it? No, definitely. I, it's not just defenders though. I think, yeah, I, like the the work rate of the forwards are putting in the midfield, they're putting in. It makes it easier for us as well. So I think the whole team is defending well. And, I mean, obviously, I guess that's how you keep clean sheets. Is just the whole team defending together. And you're looking at the league table there, and you're you're seeing like probably the three teams we expected at the start of the season: Galway and Cork City and Waterford are the top three. It's probably going to be a close battle throughout the season, isn't it, between those three? And, and I mean, you can't write off any other clubs at this early stage either. Yeah, I mean, it's the start of the season, so it's gonna be tight. It's always gonna be tight then, but uh, I mean, hopefully, we keep winning games and then we'll look back and maybe we'll be at the top a few points there but at home now on Friday they're at the bottom of the table so I mean it's a game you'd be expecting to win I suppose but uh, like I mean again you can't take anything for granted it could be the very one you slip up oh definitely I think obviously I said take one game at a time like all our focus on this game we're not looking at what's next week what's the week after that it's just all about at loan now and you know this league is you can't take any team for granted you just gotta go out and perform the same way you'd play against any other team so you can't take this lightly at all to be honest and um, just in terms of obviously you mentioned kind of the league table so if it's something you look at and you pay attention to the results I uh, try not to just because you're trying to stay in the moment but I don't know sometimes it's good to look there and see see if you're performing or not but I don't know to be fair it's not too bad to look at that now so <laughs> <laughs> yeah obviously you can be doing much better but um, just in terms of obviously the game of Friday is it, like that, is it something you obviously have to kind of carry out against complacency a bit as well in that game um Mm, I don't know. I think it's just about getting a mindset with the team and, and going out and playing the same way every week and trying to get get as much as we can out of every game. You know, so I think it's just I don't know. We're not looking at this any different than any other weeks. It's just a, it's another big game. It's the biggest game because the next game, you know. So that's the way we're preparing for. And what is what is the mood like around the place? Obviously, it must be a great place to be around the next, last few weeks. Yeah, definitely. I mean, it's definitely easier to come into training when you're winning games and see smiles on people's faces and you know it's fun to come in and push each other and hopefully continue to grow as a team in terms of your performances are you happy with them so far this season or? Uh, fairly yeah I mean missed a few headers in that but lucky to get my, my goal last week so I don't know yeah and we just well, we've only conceded one goal now so I suppose that's positive but I know we got to keep pushing on and hopefully we can add a few more from goals from the back line there and keep getting clean sheets together is that the game so would you be targeting more goals so is that a well, I mean, as long as we're winning games, it doesn't matter who's scoring, but it definitely helps the team if everyone contributes a little bit. So, I mean, Ali got a goal the other week as well, so um, yeah, definitely something that we can do as well.